One of the things that's interesting about NRF too, like you said, if it's higher and it's not because you got poisoned, then when you do get poisoned by pretty much being on an airplane or walking into an office building or smelling that person in Chanel number no. five or that that kid bathed in perfume because they haven't learned that people don't like that yet. Um, all of those actually are system level insults that go to your liver and your your kidneys and your cellular detox systems. So if your NRF2 levels are higher, your ability to be more resilient in the face of a toxic insult, even from an endotoxin from just you know eating the wrong burrito kind of a thing, like you're systemically going to be more resilient, which correlates with the longevity. It's a great yeah. example. On, and I think a lot of people don't realize that however many times you've you've got one of those giant reactive oxygen species storm and made double stem breaks in your DNA is how many times you've you've recruited all the factors that maintain your genome are recruited over to repair that double stranded break and you see you're distracting who you're supposed to stay as, you know, your development happens, you get all the genes turned on and off correctly. The rest of your life is forgetting what happened during development. Yep. And I mean, there's so many ways to get toxins, you know, you can eat them, breathe them. Like you said, you can, you know, there's a study in two thousands when I was coming out of public health school of women, um, who were breastfeeding who had um, flame retardant in their breast milk. Oh my gosh. Thank you, California, for forcing that and everything. Yeah. And so it's, and they got it from sitting on couches that had the flame retardant. And so um, having, you know, the NRF2, so, you know, sulfurophane being the best natural molecule at turning on NRF2, having that NRF2 on, you know, it's, it's, um, it's the best it, that helps with phase two de detox, basically. Mm -hmm. Um, and so, you know, being able to, um, clear those toxins, um, one of my favorite studies on detox is out of China, Hopkins was there and, you know, all these municipalities, these big cities chock filled with all these, it's um, pretty horrible. Yeah. You get black snot basically yeah. if you walk outside. And so they show just a broccoli sprout beverage, um, taken once and you peed out all these, uh, like uh, benzenes, you know, and so it, it works fast and, um, it does, it does clear the toxins. 